Of those hundreds, we know of nine people from Maine who have been charged or convicted from their actions that day. They include Kimberly Sylvester from Auburn, Matthew Brackley of Walderboro, Glenn Mitchell Simon of Minot, Joshua Colgan from Jefferson, Nicholas Hendricks of Gorham, Todd Tilly of South Paris, David Ball from Wells, Christopher Murrer of Biddeford, and Kyle Fitzsimons of Lebanon. Since then, lawmakers across the country have spoken out about the riots. While the events didn't actually stop Congress from certifying the election results, Maine's independent Senator Angus King said that day that he believed the riot highlighted how delicate our democracy really is. It's fragile and it rests upon trust. It rests upon trust in facts. It rests upon trust in courts in public officials, and yes, in elections. And today, Democratic Congresswoman Shelley Pingree released a statement calling January 6, 2021, one of the darkest moments in American history, while also saying, quote, we should mark this day with awareness that our democracy endures, but is fragile, and that the work of democracy is never finished, always evolving, and requires our constant attention.